Hello everyone and welcome back to the next Let's Play 4 on Link. Well, once again, we're taking another look at the ARC mission storyline, this time on Shiny Hammer. Shiny Hammer is another attack on the Runmore Corporation, this time specifically their local area network. ARC is, again, as usual, annoyed that a Runmore is gaining on the revelation virus so they want us to go attack their land destroy all data and take the computer down to make sure that their data is considerably behind what it was though you would think that a run more would have more backups to prevent that but apparently that's not so much the case as we will soon find out the administrator, as usual, for us anyway, is Freda Hughes, and she has done a lot better job on this network than the ARC's Candy did on hers. It is, I mean, as far as lands are co concerned, I'd say I'd find this one to be a lot more interesting than the ARC one that we just did in the last couple videos, because... When it comes to challenge, this one at least was thought, thought through pretty well. It's not fully that challenging, it's pretty much the same as usual, but it's interesting enough that you would want to do it a couple times, at least for the fun of it. So, either way, the faith as you saw was actually at 5.0. So, if we did not do this mission and we wanted to do the ARC mission storyline for the final mission, which is coming up next, it will be considerably more difficult if I do not do this mission. So, I would rather do this mission and get it over with than have a very, very difficult time trying to figure out what to do against the faith antivirus another thing that comes to my mind though is on this mission they're actually paying you 30,000 now considering the fact that this is an anti-capitalist anarchist group do you honestly think that they should be paying you I mean besides that is the money gonna be any good when the internet is completely destroyed because obviously revelation is not going to just destroy one system it's going to take out the whole internet so i don't know i certainly wouldn't want to really work for these guys for real that's for certain you wouldn't actually get anything out of it you're basically in reality working for free because as soon as the internet goes down there goes all your money that's not exactly uh, very comforting, at least as far as I'm concerned. I would rather actually get some cash out of it. Meh, nonetheless. Anyway, that's just me. Either way, so what we're going to be doing now is just erasing the logs as usual. And going to the file server and erasing all of the data. I could have just simply probably put Revelation on there and erased all of the files that way but I didn't really think it through I really wish I had but hey that's how it goes sometimes you think ahead and sometimes you don't either way the machine is dead and that is really all there is to it we just send, send off a reply and there we go congratulations it looks like you pulled off the job with your usual skill and style. Seems good enough to me. Not, see, there. It, it, they even mentioned that there's backups. That should tell you everything. If they have backups, then what was the point of all that? Anyway, that's it for this episode. See you guys next time.